Yo, what up? It's good. It's Ricky Tyson. Have you got your free phone today? Have you got your free cell phone today? Do you got Medicaid? Do you got food stamps? Do you got your free phone today? That's what these fucking single mothers are doing right now in front of the train station of Broadway Junction. Along with some gentlemen, but they don't look so bad. There's one guy in a suit, but he look presentable. But the, oh my gosh, these women are just fucking hideous. Show you an example out there. All right. They're out there. They're in front of the station. They're, they're out there. I mean, got your free phone today? Straight up bugging. Yesterday was hot. It was humid. It was muggy. I couldn't even walk. I couldn't even walk past the station just to not get stopped by these hideous creatures asking me if I want a free phone. I told them, look, I don't qualify. Oh, um, did you have food stamps before in the past? Like, I had food stamps in the past in 2006 to 2007 because child support was raping me. And whatever little money I was making from my, from my job, they took it. So every week I will come home with like, normally before child support, I was coming home with like two to three hundred dollars uh, every week, depending on overtime. But now when child support came in, they fucking raped me. I was coming back home with at least a hundred dollars and change every week. How you expect me to live off of that? I couldn't even pay my rent. I was running out of, I was running out of a nice, it was a nice studio too. It was by my good friend who let me have the, have the place. And he was only charging me 600 a month. I was saving up monies and stuff so I can get, you know what I'm saying, better place. But did you get your free phone? Oh, you don't qualify. I'm like, no, no, no. I tell him straight up, I don't qualify. I got TRICARE. I got TRICARE and whatever health benefits I get from my job. Oh, that's too bad. Well, my friend got one, though. Because she gets food stamps. Because she has a disability. But she don't look like she's disabled. Well, she has a disability, though. So, that's what I'm seeing right now. I gotta go through the fucking gauntlet just to get inside the Broadway Junction train station so I can go turn in and be able to get the fuck out of Brooklyn and go back to New Jersey. Man, it's hideous out here. I'm seeing women, I'm seeing more kids pushing kids in strollers. Oh yeah, that question about financial freedoms when it comes to child support. I'm saying, I'm saying when it comes to child support, it, it takes money out of your checks. You're pretty much, you have no financial means to your kids. It comes out of child support. Every week, every two weeks, every month, it comes out of child support. It's just like you didn't marry, you didn't marry the woman. You didn't marry the bitch, but she took it to child support and stuff. It seemed like it's like. It's like a fucking paying spousal support and all that other bullshit. You know what I'm saying? That's the answer to the question. That's why I would say, shit, I'm on financial freedoms. The shit comes out, the money comes out my check, it goes to my son. Done deal. Nothing else follows. You know? But did you get your free phone? You gotta be quick, though. They're gonna be over here. I don't know how long, but they got those, uh, those nice little uh, touchscreen phones. And stuff that you know people are starting to sport now. There's like three different companies over here giving out free phones. Man, I could have had one. Shit, you know how much money I would save me on one of my phone bills? I would have cut. I would have. Man, I would have cut that number off. So y'all, um, come back a little bit later.
got some off my chest by my son. So, Ricky Tice, peace out.